Hello, people, this is Bear from a Wave, and uh, today we're going to take a look at the Nasdaq, so our weekly update. Before we get started, as usual, if you want to ask me any questions, uh, feel free to join the Discord, it's absolutely free, uh, and the link is down below. And uh, if you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe, I really appreciate it. We're very close to uh, 2,500 subs, and um, obviously, all of this is free. And if you want me to keep it up, then all I ask in return is. You guys subscribe, watch, comment, like, whatever. Anything that helps the algorithm, the YouTube uh, algorithms that is unknown to um, us ordinary people is really appreciated. Now, enough has been said. What is happening with the NASDAQ? Uh, so the quick answer is, I don't know. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next no, Just kidding. Um, obviously, I don't know, as usual. If I knew, I wouldn't be here. But... My best guess is the one you're looking at right now. I'm going to stick to the one you're looking at. So, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, four, five into wave one. Now, now, if I zoom out, you can see I'm anticipating a potential wave five, cycle wave five. Now, you may ask, Barrett. Could we be topping into that wave five, this wave five right here, the cycle one? Well, many times wave five are as long as wave one, or Ponzi is 20 times the length of wave ones. Ponzi is 20 times was reached at 20,000. Equality stands at 30,000. What does it mean? Well, uh, could we be close to a, a, a topping wave five? Yes. Uh, but remember, if we were that close, so let's say even we top at 30,000, right? Then we would need to enter this wave 4. That would have to pair up with this wave 2. So you get something like this, back you in the 10,000 at least, and then upside. Now, if we also measure uh, what I label as super cycle wave 3 against 1, let me get rid of this. Okay. Equality stands at 35,000. So we could even aim to 1.618. And at that point, we could be, uh, you know, into uh, prime, uh, yeah, yes, primary one of five. So one more high, pull back, infinity and beyond. Now you may ask, Barry, what the hell have you, have you just, drunk um, I mean it's always the same story if you look at it like this you see a 1 2 1 2 look look at how much you moved to the upside 2000% right uh, it can happen again that's what I'm saying being as I always say on the channel being, being bearish I mean, it's not bad. It's, it's been conservative. Being conservative, uh, I learned that being conservative um, is worse than being extremely, I mean, extremely, than being not as much conservative. Now, let's get back to the daily. Um, obviously, turning view moves my waves. You, you, you already know that if you've been hanging around the channel. Now, what is happening with this wave four? Well, that's a good question. Uh, I'm gonna take you to the uh, intraday in just a second. Uh, it is possible we could enter a sideways wave four, so some sort of a triangle. Oopsie. That's possible. Now, if we, as you may know, I always say correction on the same degree will tend towards equality. Equality of four against two stands at eighteen thousand two hundred dollars, right here, and look what happened around there. Surprised? Not. Now, uh, as long as we keep trading within equality, I will remain with this view of a um, intermediate four in the making. 
um, knowing that we could get sideways until we form some sort of a triangle. Now, if we go straight to the hourly, that's when you see the labeling. Obviously, Dream View moves my waves. You already know that. Thank you, Dream View. Very much appreciate it for that $200 I give you a year. Um, now, one, two, one, two, three, four, five. That was last update. So far, so good. Now, it's possible we are in this way four. Um, we're gonna have to see. Um, ideally, we would need to fail, so move back down today. Um, so yeah, around eighteen thousand eight hundred would be ideal. And uh, if not, if not, then it opens up the possibility. A B C A B C A B C into wave C A B C into wave D A B C into wave E of four your triangle upside. That's possible. Um, which one is going to be? <laughs> if I knew, I wouldn't be here. So I wish I could tell you, uh, but I don't know. Um, uh, by looking at, at individual stocks, I would not discount the possibility of a triangle um, because I see some moving higher, Apple, for instance, uh, some moving lower, uh, Amazon. Uh, uh, you can go check my tech stock video on the channel. Um, so it, it, it makes, you know, some move, I'm talking about the big ones, obviously some I can see moving higher, some moving lower. They, it could result to a sideways uh, movement in the NASDAQ. Now I think that's going to be it. Um, again, I don't know if we're going to get a five wave move wave C or in four or a triangle in four. Uh, those are my two best scenarios. Uh, I don't like. I mean, I will not consider for the time being um, this scenario where we have a wave one in place, downside, upside. But I could be wrong. So it, it, the market needs to prove me right or wrong. And uh, we'll see. But uh, so far, I prefer discount. Am I right? Am I wrong? Time will tell. Thank you for watching, and uh, I will see you in the next one.